I'm Hugh Hefner, editor of Butcher Playboy magazine. From that harem of girls to the smoking jacket and the polarizing product he created. Playboy exploits sex like Sports Illustrated exploits sport. Hugh Hefner wasn't always beloved, <laughs> but he was always noticed. Late Wednesday, his estate announced he died in his sleep at the Playboy Mansion. The son of two devout school teachers, Hefner first published Playboy in conservative 1953. On that cover, Marilyn Monroe. By the 1970s, Playboy was selling 7 million copies a month. A pageant of American women posed. Sharon Stone, Kim Basinger, Cindy Crawford, and Drew Barrymore. Playboy took flack from both conservatives and feminists. Most memorably in this sparring session between Gloria Steinem, publisher of Miss, and Hefner, 35 years after she went undercover as a Playboy bunny. I do not find the body of work admirable, but at all. Uh, I think it's part of the problem, not part of the solution. We do know that in the, at every kind of level, that, you know, there is, there is the pursuer and the pursuit. That's uh, not true. Indeed, Hefner recently said he wanted to be remembered as a trailblazer of sexuality. I would like to be remembered as somebody who played some positive part in changing the social sexual values of my time. That was Matt Gutman reporting in Los Angeles.